Hi. Hi, how are you doing? I'm wonderful, how are you? Good, how exciting to get the first ever Gamer Stories Award. Uh, it's definitely exciting. I've never ever, I don't think I've ever been on like television, you know, besides the Ellen Show, I've never been on yeah. TV, so this is going to be fun. Say, you've been on the Ellen, you one of the biggest gamers in the world. Yeah. Did you ever expect kind of to have a Gamer Stories Award for gaming to get as huge as no, definitely not. I think that uh, Fortnite is a huge part of it to kind of push gaming into the the norm and and kind of into the mainstream scene. So. Yeah. yeah. What um what was that like to be like on the Ellen Show and to kind of like be do you, are you more recognized now or you were already? Successful? I don't think I was more recognized. I think it was kind of like a like a lot of parents. Like my goal is I always want parents to know you know that my, my stream and all the content that I produce is, is child you know kid friendly and things like that, which is it was great. It was wonderful, but um. Yeah, no, I, I think it was just something that was really cool to do. I, I've always loved Ellen, and my wife has been a big fan of her shows all the time. So when we found out they were interested in doing stuff with us, we jumped on board right away. Whenever you first started gaming when you were younger, I assume, did your parents ever kind of give you grief? Not, not necessarily grief. They just made sure that, like, I was, I was, I was being active outside. So, it, uh, you know, during the summer and things like that, they were like, all right, it's, you know, summertime. So you're going to, you have every day, which I think was like a three hour limit for video games. And if I played for three hours, I would need to go outside. And every hour I played outside, I got to play video games. So I'd wake up, you know, 8 a.m., play video games for three hours, and then go outside, play for six hours, you know, like running around with my best friends for six hours, a long time doing, you know, whatever, and then come inside and just, you know, finish the night off. Just so you could play games? Yeah, 100%. Yeah. I literally were like, oh, all right, hey, guys, because like everyone kind of had the same ruling in our neighborhood. Yeah. So we're like, all right, it's time to hang out, and we all hang out together and just play video games again. Oh, my God, that's incredible. It was awesome. So Kiss is performing tonight. Yes. How excited are you? My parents are huge Kiss fans, and I've obviously loved their music for a long time, so I'm definitely pumped to ever. I, I, I don't see a lot of rock bands live at all yeah. since streaming is so demanding, so it's going to be pretty awesome. Yeah, why do you think they're so perfect for an event like that? I mean, I think that dude, Kiss is perfect for every event. <laughs> Come on, are you serious? There's no question. One more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell. Never miss a video.